Hey, what is up, people? Hey, everybody. It is your buddy, Blake Trout here. I'm here, nicely, newly rebranded, and ready to give out my first real video of 2023 with our brand new series, 100 Tests. During this session, we have 100 battles involving each VGC team that I make and develop myself and to test, and to understand, and to adapt, and to learn. This kind of feels like a bit like Blue Lock, where I'm about to figure out what my zero one is with this team. Turning zero into one, then turning one into 100. That is the goal of using each team. I really gotta stop watching Blue Lock, but it's actually a lot of fun. Watch it, read it, it is some good stuff. But back to the task at hand. This is the team I built, that I kind of just was thinking in my head to make, make sense. I tried making a couple changes to it at a time. Uh, if I really look at it, I kind of have an idea of why I did what I did. So, it's these are the six Pokemon. Tyranitar, Garchomp, Goldengo, Sylveon, Meowskarada, Talonflame. So I'm gonna basically talk about each of the six for a little bit and then get into each one and then we'll just go through the session. So it'll probably be like really long for part one and then I guess I'll just do 10 battles at a time. I think we'll have 10 parts. Maybe I'll shorten it where I'll just do one for 20 battles. I don't have a lot going on, but you know, it's a pretty long day. And really, we're here to just test. I'm not really looking for, oh, we gotta be the best of the best. Nah, we just gotta practice. And I'm pretty much going really simple, low key. I mean, uh, let's talk about each one so far, right? Uh, as we get into it, there's Tyranitar with Weakness Policy, Sandstream, Rock Slide, Terra Blast, Crunch, and Protect. Uh, I gave it the flying terra typing, although rock or ghost may be more ideal. I, I kind of thought in my head doing flying since that would defensively help us with uh, just covering the flying and the dark, flying and with fighting in the ground. Also, uh, you know, it just helps with deal with that. And we also have some type of like a bit of defensive coverage. So, I mean, hey, we do lose to electric, ice, and rock, but. We kind of have coverage for the ice. So we should be fine. I did ground terror typing, life orb, guard charm with earthquake, dragon claw, protect, and swords dance. Um, realistically, the reason why I did swords dance might not make any sense. I don't think I probably would not need, would need really swords dance. I did sand veil because, you know, pretty good synergy with the sand and all that and such. Not only that, cool. that it does it pretty hefty. Life Orb's nice. I mean, Rough Skin Rocky Helmet could have been also a good choice, but I didn't really decide against that. And then we have Goldango. I've never used this Pokemon before in VGC, so it looked interesting. So I did Steel Terra Typing, I guess for a better defensive make. Make it Rain, Shadow Ball, Thunderbolt, and Trick. Uh, I guess Thunderbolt so I could be able to touch Don Dozo in some way. Trick is to be able to shut down attackers or anybody that's trying to do anything crazy. Just if we don't, you know, trick into something stupid, we should be fine. Sylveon, uh, I gave it the fire terror typing with Pixelate, Hyper Voice, Terror Blast, Protect, and Yawn. Uh, I could have probably added a third attack. I'm actually going to ditch Leftovers for Throat Spray, though, since we should just base it off of power at this point. Uh, Meowskarada has Overgrow, but really the idea of me, you know, using Sylveon um, his stat distribution is more so a bit of a defensive build with Modest, so we can hit pretty hard. With a plus one boost, we have that. Uh, fire Terror type, so we can block up against Steel and, and Poison types pretty well. Fire is pretty decent offensively because that gives us ability to hit Steel, Flot Grass, and other stuff for super effective damage. We also have Meowskarada with Overgrow, Flower Trick, Knockoff, Protect, and Sucker Punch. I might ditch focus sash for something else since I mean it kind of feels pointless if we're dealing with Tyranitar on the team uh, I mean shoot probably get rid of it for I guess Miracle Seed you know Overgrow with the crass Terra typing just to do out have a larger output of damage Flower Trick crit so it's pretty nice and uh, I'm very proud of this Talonflame set a 252 HP 252 speed, Jolly Nature, Talonflame with Tailwind, will o -Wisp, Brave Bird, and Taunt. Taunt helps us shut down certain setup. Uh, Tailwind is to give us that speed advantage. will o -Wisp is pretty nice. It helps cripple out the physical attackers. And Safety Goggles so it can hand survive in it. I mean, I think, honestly, we could have replaced this with Rage Powder uh, Volcarona. Because Volcarona can make a really good support. 
So that's the 10 we're gonna, we're gonna be using for about 100 battles. We're gonna basically, you know, configure, change it up every now and then. Yeah, I know Series 2 just put itself up on Showdown for doubles, but um, we're gonna probably just stick with Series 1 until the end of this month and then move on to Series 2 and such. And you know, that's pretty much it. So let's see what our first battle is going to be. And just like that, uh, I don't know what I'm facing. This is my first battle with this generation. Open team sheets. Um, so we have a species clause and an item clause. Is that an actual thing in the meta? All right. Uh, I don't know what open team sheets are, so I'm gonna reject that. So we got to pick our lead options right now, and I think uh, starting a timer would be quick just to do something like this. Um, so he basically has nearly the same exact team as me, except uh, Seru Ledge. I do appreciate that a lot with uh, Goldango. He also has a Miascarada, but has Hydreigon instead, and water. That is fun. That's going to be a fun thing to deal with. So I think, um, let's do Garchomp Sylveon. And then have Miascarada Goldango. All right, so here's where I think we might have um, not overestimated. I think he's gonna go Terra Steel. So realistically, I'll expect that. I'm gonna go Protect. I'm gonna go Terrestrialize Fire on the War. That's what I thought. So Wave Crash. That's smart. Flash Cannon. We eat that. And it's life orb. We go with the Terra Blast. Do a lot of damage there. All right. So realistically, oh wait, you don't. We can't use that. So I went for the Swords Dance. Mirror Herb? What? That is crazy. That is crazy. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm not gonna trick. Yep, that probably wasn't the move. And look at that. <laughs> what a way to start. So go right into Serial Edge Garchomp. Oh, this isn't good. He's gonna go for Earthquake. So. Yeah, we, pro we pretty much just lost this one. That was a pretty good way to have him back. I mean, we're still stuck on that, figuring out what would be the perfect lead. But, uh, kind of nutty. That was a pretty nutty first turn. Oh, goes for Rock Slide instead. And goes for Bitter Blade. We die there. It is what it is with that. Goes for the Yawn. And goes for Protect here. So, yeah, we kind of just lost this one pretty badly. Could have had a better uh, lead option, but we just ignored that. Put to sleep. We have nothing that can hit Sarah Ledge. Ah, <sighs> well, that wasn't good. It is what it is with that one. Um, GG's on that one. So we're 0-1 to start. So I think that really could have gone better if we had a better lead option. I mean, what did we do? We did... We didn't even do Goldango. We did, um... Serata. Alright, so... Mirror Herb, of all things. Alright, it's nice to learn that. So this could be a Trick Room team. Actually, this is starting to look like a Trick Room team. A weird Trick Room mix with this thing. And it's probably going to have like some type of a uh, thing. So let's try to go a little anti-speed here. Sylveon, Goldango. 
actually no, do Goldingo Tyranitar, and then go for, uh, actually back that up, do Talonflame Tyranitar, and go, hmm, Goldingo Garchomp in the back. Cyclazar and Mimikyu. So I'm going to taunt the Mimikyu. And Rock Slide for a bit of damage. I mean, taunting Mimikyu would make more sense since my only fear is that he's going to go for that. Shed Tail. Alright, see, I, I semi expected that. So I didn't know Shed Tail was dead ass like that. Ooh, wait, I shouldn't say dead ass. My bad. <laughs> uh, going for the play rough. Jeez, that did too much. Tailwind. And rock slide again. I only did taunt to kind of get rid of the fear of, um, I guess, you know. Baxalibur, though, is kind of scary. I like Baxalibur a lot, though. It's one of my favorite Pokemon of this generation. I'm assuming that it had, like, Trick Room or something crazy, but it had Play Rough out the gate, so I don't know what this thing has. We should tank. Because I sure... And we die to that. Oh, that sucks. That freaking sucks. This one we're trying we're at least figuring out what he has. So that's good. So far though, it's pretty crazy. Um, kind of think about it, he might I don't really know what's gonna be happening. Again, I'm just getting into this. This is the first battle. So he could protect into something or switch out, but we know that three out of his four he has a uh, ghost shadow sneak. Thermal exchange. Whoo, alright. Yeah, there we go. That's a lot of power. That is a lot of power. Skeledurge and Cyclozar. So, I know what I'm doing. Is Cyclozar more physical or special? Guess we'll do that. And then go... And make it rain, just to do some more damage on top. Actually, better yet. Albridge doesn't do anything. Torch Song kills me, that's cool. He didn't... Well, actually, it wouldn't matter. I'd say go for this, and then I would go Terrastalize Earthquake. So, putting this in the back was a pretty good idea. Yep, that's what I assumed. So we survived that. Okay, I did a lot. Critical hit. Goes for the Shadow Ball. We die to that, but we will survive. Uh... I'll just keep going for Terrassal Earthquake, because that did what? 50%? All right, that's another win. GG. A nice quick one. That was good. So yeah, it's gonna be kind of hard. I don't know. If I can really like verbalize it. Like I'm not um, I'm not like Wolfie or I'm not like Wolf Click or Aaron Zane, but ah, uh, you know, we got it working. Got it working. So here it is. It's a weird. I think it's like a rain slash stone team. So this is gonna be weird. This is gonna be weird. I think we're gonna get freaky with it on this one. 
And I'm going to go Garchomp and Goldango. Put Tyranitar in the back. And I'll have, and I'll have, and I'll have... Sylvia. Dragapult and Floatzel, Garchomp and Goldango. Oh man, I have no idea what I'm expecting here. So I think I'll just protect and go for... Not Terra Steel. Sucker Punch. And then Blizzard. Hmm. Oh, he'll just... This is a whole thing in battle. This is kind of stupid, because see what happens? Those surf and we just... Yep! So this is like, we're just going to win to the weather. So... <laughs> And for battle three, we survive by just doing that. <laughs> uh, so GG's on that one. The weather saved us at the end. So yeah, Terra Steel specs make it rain. Holy crap, that does so much damage. Don't really like us being like that extremely weak towards it, but it is what it is. I think we did pretty good in that weather matchup because I was thinking like he could have gone snow and he could have gone rain and he went rain. So at least the cool thing is we can shut down other weather teams. I just don't like having to rely on that. So let's go into Talonflame and... Suppose Goldango. Then have... Uh... Tyranitar's... Sylveon in the back. Oh boy. I have no idea what open team sheets are. So, that must be something new. So, he's gonna go Grim Snarl Halucha. That should work. And then we should use. Stuck with Terra Blast. Hmm. It's gonna hit Tel Goldango. I 
kind of just bit the bullet on this one. Okay, so unfortunately I crashed. That's not good. So we just lost a lot of good stuff for nothing. And now, uh, that's being annoying with all the restarting startups. So I guess that freaking, just leave me alone. I guess we're stuck with that L. I guess it makes us two and two. Way to start it off, uh, complete crash. Didn't even notice that coming. So what have I even learned in that loss? We got cooked in the first turn. We didn't even see it coming. Yeah. Okay, this is the Sun team, pretty much. And it's everything I wanted to make with this, because it's Scovillain, so it's probably got Spicy Extract. To, ugh, defiant. And that's cool. That That's coolly cool. You know? So Rangaroo and Gronald. That's cool. I'm gonna taunt you. Fake out. What? Let me guess. Trick room. Yep. Not what I wanted to have happen. We ate that. That's crazy. Going Torkoal. I no choice here. Dang, even in the sun, even in the sun. See, so it's that annoying feeling where it's like we got outplayed and we did. I'm not even mad about this. crash was pretty freaking annoying. Going for the Earth Power, so we tank that. Goes for foul play, which doesn't do much. Great Bird kicks in and still doesn't do anywhere near enough. That's cool by me. I'm going to trade the Rock Slide. Take that, let that kick in. What's he got left? King Gambit. That's fun. That's fun. At all. That's all fun and things. So, so hey, hey, I have an idea. I have an idea. Let me do that again. And I'm gonna actually, I'm gonna protect and then Will O Wisp the King Gambit. Ha!
And he forfeits. Fallen. And I had nothing else to hit the King Gambit with. Because at least we tank. We definitely tank that. And just go for Rock Slide and Brave Bird. And just pray we don't lose. <laughs> so that was good. Hey, we hit 1100. Nice. So, uh, next. So how are we doing so far? I don't know. I have not gotten to use Meow Skirata once. And I'm really tempted to go for Terra Dark. Just so I can do something. Yeah, I'm gonna probably change it. So I guess, uh, ugh, this looks like a Parish Trap team or something. I bet you're like Terra, yeah, Terra Fairy or Terra Steel. I don't know. Uh, yeah, you also have that too. You know what? Let's go Town Flame. Town Flame, Tyranitarus. Actually, Town Flame. Yeah. Town Flame, Tyranitar. With Miascarod in the back. Mm. Spamming Goldango is not going to save me. So we'll do this instead. Got the Tell Hatterene, Talonflame, Tyranitar. So here's my idea, right? Something, something feels pretty obvious. It's going to be probably some type of trick room stunt. Uh, I can sense it. I could just uh, taunt the Gothitelle. Or maybe you're going to be Terra fighting or something. I don't know. You sound like you'll do that. I'm gonna definitely just pile, dog pile the, um... I'll just use... Yep. See, this is like another instance... I guess it's like another instance of where we're like, hey, so we could have done this better. Like the fake out should have been obvious. Hypnosis, really? Like that hit. Wow. Damn. All right, let's go for hyper voice. That is lame. That is so lame, but it is what it is. So the annoying parts. And then just like then we get eaten alive by Trick Room. It's like we have taunt, but what's the point? Like Mystical Fire, that was a smart play. And then we get put asleep. Really? That's all I can do. So yeah, uh, it's gonna just be that painful set where it's just hypnosis hitting even though it's 60 accuracy. But it is what it is. It's that we can't stop them from setting up Trick Room. Oh cool, we woke up. Stuck. So I'm gonna protect. Oh, I already did. Gonna be Ascarada. No. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh my god. I wanted to switch into Miascarada and then go into the So I'm gonna listen to King Gambit. Yes, I'll try. And you'll just hit you with a sucker punch. And then it's like, what's the point of trying? You're just gonna get cooked each time. Or no, you do this instead, that's fine. Yeah, see what I mean? Actually, this is better. Burning you is better. Because I think we don't win this. We, 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 we are just crippled. You wonder what would have been a better idea? Leading into Goldango. Because guess what? We hit everything still. And the annoying part is that happens. Sucker Punch kills. We just lose here. And this is another instance of getting outplayed. 
So I guess we're three and three now. So, uh, nothing I can really do. Uh, what have I even learned in this? I don't think I learned anything. Uh, all I learned is that hypnosis just doesn't miss. And that's cool. Foul play doesn't kill us because he's only in the Actually, Talent Link can take some punishment. That's cool. But, um. Like, Taunt's good, but it's just not Prankster good. Sucker Punch fails. You go for Taunt. I don't think he even Terra Blasted yet. And we keep jumping the gun Terra, right? And it just goes bad every time. Ugh. All right, so three and three so far. I'm getting cooked. <laughs> it's back and forth. I think the only thing I'm getting cooked in is that first turn where I just don't know anything. So I'm not gaining any instinct on what to expect for a lead. And I'm still stuck on figuring out what lead option is just perfect. Maybe I'm not feeling any synergy. Uh, Talonflame Goldingo. Right? You probably are normal Terra. This. I still don't know what it, this does. I think Garchomp will do. And then Tyranitar will do. Goes in the Grafai. You have either Prankster. There's some type of Prankster set. So that's cool. Oh, wait a minute. I have an eye. Actually. I'm going to go for Swords Dance and then taunt the Cloud Sire. Because here's the thing, right? I don't know what you do. And part of me feels like you're going to tear right here. Knocking off my safety goggles. Chilling water. That is cool. So I'm going to Terra Ground Earthquake. And then... Hmm. I guess it was just Will-O-Wisp. I feel like that's my only option, and I don't really know if anything else will kind of work. I need to keep Talonflame alive, so I'm going to probably... No, don't go into Tyranitar yet. So go for, um... Are you going to All right, that does a good amount. And there we go. Then goes low key toxicity and Amoongus. I'm gonna go Earthquake again. And then taunt the Amoongus. Normal. Exactly what I thought. And there we go. Puts us to four and three. So I think Talonflame and Garchomp is a pretty good combination. So I see another rain team and I see Palafin in the right there. I'm very not very terrified of that. Uh, so 
I think at worst speed wise it's gonna be 167. We don't outspeed that. But actually, Town Flame Goldango would be nice. And then have Garchomp in the back somewhere with Meowskarata. And then you know the funny thing is you got that bird right there. Actually, fast drop, 195 to 190. So we just outspeed Kilowattro. But with wind power, right? And I forgot what wind power does. I think that boosts something. Because there's wind power, competitive, and bolt absorb. And those are both really good abilities. So Palafin, Pelipper. Yeah, that's that's not what I want to deal with. I'm gonna do Tailwind. Tailwind Trick? Oh, wait a minute. Wide Guard. Okay, we made the right play here. We over, they over assume, and your Volt Absorb. All right, cool, cool. I would probably, Switch you out in the Meowskarada. Actually, no. Thunder. Oh, that's lame. <laughs> RuPaul's Dragon Ball is a pretty funny name. So far, uh, it's a really bad back and forth. We kind of just, we kind of over, like we did the right move where we had Thunderbolt, but I wasn't sure if Kilowatch was going to be Wind Power or Volt Absorb. Still, like, Volt Absorb or Wind Power, like all three abilities are valid to me. Wind Power helps boost up during the wind, uh, but it only works when it's on itself or flying type moves just get thrown at it. Going for Thunder again, that's not going to kill us. Spore doesn't work. So that's cool. Oh wait, went for Spore again? Did you just know I was gonna switch out? So we went for Sucker Punch and got Parahaxed. We really got Parahaxed twice. Man, this sucks. Wait, do we not actually have anything for the ring? We didn't even have... You see, here's a mistake. Whenever I see Dra Drizzle, I really screwed up here. Hurricane. Okay. So we don't get Parahax. Look at that. Sucker Punch did that much to Aquila Watrol. So we'll use Sucker Punch to check Aquila Watrol and we'll be fine. And we still have Goldingo in the back. And now Palafin's just there. So the annoying part is like, well. Do something. That's cool. Still asleep. Going for the least one. That's not gonna kill us. So we forever now have him stuck. So I think we're gonna do Terra Dark for Meowskaron instead of Terra Grass. I just don't see a point. I think that's gonna be the way I'm gonna switch it up. And kills Kilo Watcho. Still asleep. Calm Puff fails. Those Palfin Hero. Jet punch it too hard.
What do you mean you have Rocky Helmet? Falcon screwed us. GG on that one. This red bird was more than enough to be fast. Just jet punches. Yo. Yeah, we got cooked. We got cooked. That puts us at four and four. What a way to start this video. It's gonna be half and half for this one. Thought I felt pretty confident, and now I just feel like, you know, it's not the worst. We got wins at least, but holy crap. <laughs> oh, this is already not working out, and it's already becoming a bad time. It's okay. It's okay. All right, so I see another situation with another rain team. I am this time, this time, going into Garchomp Talonflame. Okay? Is that okay? Am I allowed to do that? Go to Tyranitar and Meowskarot. Kilowattrol and Garchomp. All right, that's cool. I don't even care. Better yet. I think Talonflame Garchomp is probably my, my best. Uh, what is it? So here's my uh, massive issue, right? He'll switch out into rain. Yep, goes right into gold. Game That's cool. Should have speed, right? Damn. Well, I'm very upset because we could have easily knocked stuff out. I think I'm going to probably do something different. <laughs> 